on the Silver Ridge Peaks. And we are going to be going after some turkeys. It's that time of year again, spring. Spring, Wisconsin. Those gobblers are starting to get hormonal, if you know what I mean. They're really starting to go ham. So, uh, we're going to find some turkey zones here, some known known areas and uh see what we can do got turkey there turkey there now there's some good areas up in this this region why don't we go take a look up there yeah why don't we do that We got some turkeys up here. Yep. Got to mirror them up there. Now these guys are really vocal, so let's see if I can see them. Yep, there he is. About 170 yards out. So I'm just gonna crawl out here. Pop up my. Uh, Decoys quick. Now, you can do this in real life. You know, I got some tall grass. Not ideal to put your decoy in tall grass. But, when they're 175 yards out like that, you can make it work. I'm just going to drop back. Let's crawl out there. You know, I try to play this as realistic as possible. And in a situation like this, that turkey has hung up. And you got some tall grass in front of you. See now, I think he's pretty damn close to me. So I'm just gonna run. There he is. Shoot. Sometimes you just gotta make your move. They may be running away, but sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do. If they're boogering, you better shoot. Pop up, shoot. 68 yards. Now that's not the most ethical shot to take. Definitely do not recommend it. But, doesn't matter. We got them down. It's just a game. Just shy of diamond there, but you know, it's a nice bird. I'm happy. Located some birds up here, up on the ridge, behind this outpost up here. We're up in the Swiss Valley. Kind of getting later morning here, so we're probably just out feeding around a little bit. Hard to, to tell. They're up there a ways by the looks of it. Oh, right there. A lot closer than I thought. Oh, she's coming right in. Oh, Mister, pick up the shotgun. Oh shoot, we still have slugs in. Get the bird shot in. There we go. Quick transition. 
Got a hen down here, headshot, going away. Sweet, another turkey. Wow. I'm pretty sure that's a... Pretty sure that could be a diamond potential. The sucker's at about 93. That should do. 12 gauge slug hits hard. Surprised he even made it that far. Oh, just short. We actually had some turkeys over here calling. That direction. She's fired up. Look at this. She's coming right in to the deeks. Here she is, right on top of us. Dropped her. Absolutely smoked her. I mean, if you actually look at the broadheads on this bow, it's the uh, like uh, the guillotine. I mean, heavy pounded. It's devastating on a turkey. But cool looking hen. Get her decoys out. Come here, old son. Get him fired up here. Oh, there he is. It's a good looking gobbler right there. Oh. Here he comes. That should have rolled him. And he's down. And you know, when you hit him right, right about here in the base of the neck, that usually does the trick. Yeah, it says no organ sit. I mean, honestly, you're going for the headshot. Yeah. 36 yards. Base of the neck. Doesn't get much better than that. Sweet. Another gold. We're just gonna get up here. Also, I mean, six shells for trick gunning. Most states, it's three. Gotta put a plug in your gun. But, uh,. Gotta take the shot now. Yup, got him. Man, that was a crazy cool flock of turkeys. Might go after them. 
a couple uh couple white hens, you know, maybe you can uh say they're bearded hens or something, you know, make it realistic. That turkey was weird, he's got a white tail fan. And he has a brown body, I thought. Yeah, when they're boogering, just gotta shoot. I mean, time's up when they start running. Wow. Look at that. That's a cool looking bird. Snap a quick picture of that. See what he came out to be. Gold. Yeah, 54 yards is, depending on your choke and your shot, your shell choice, that's probably the outer range. Definitely not ideal, but did the job. Body hit on a bird at 54 yards probably isn't going to take him down, but uh, you can see maybe we clipped the spine there a little bit, even though it doesn't say it, but... Uh, yeah, he's down. Another time in the books.